Two down and two to go for the Clovis Rodeo. It was another energetic and successful night in Old Town Clovis. CBS 47's Tony Body joins us live outside of the rodeo grounds in Clovis where a country music just wrapped up. Yeah, that's right, Ken, and that music show was put on by rising country star Dustin Lynch. Now, prior to that, our camera was busy rolling inside of the arena to give you an up-close look at the action. That's Casey Rose shooting out of the gate on the back of his bull named Wildly Legit. The 23-year-old is a true hometown boy, as he was raised right here in Clovis. To have this whole crowd behind your back, you couldn't ask for more, man. This is a great place. It's a really good rodeo, and we damn sure appreciate all these fans and everything. Earlier in the evening, the Bronx were bucking, and cowboys showed off their ability to rope calves and tie them down in mere seconds. Talent which delighted fans, including Joe Harper, who has been coming to this event since 1972. I was raised on a cattle ranch, and this is probably my roots, and I love it. Other entertainment came from Charo Tomas Garcia Lazo, who showed off his dazzling display of lassoing. Ladies and gentlemen, there's nobody else in the world that can do what that guy does. Demetrio Aguilar sure appreciates his skills. It's a craft. You know, what he did is a craft to, to twirl the to rope. And it's something that you just get really pumped up. Come on, let's go! And the art of mutton busting continues to be a hit. A total of 10 little guys grabbed under the wool of sheep and tried to ride it out. Seven-year-old Landon Wolf gave it a go for his first time. He didn't get far, but was quick to recognize what he did wrong. I wasn't holding on it tight enough. Nevertheless, Landon's willingness to try something new sure made his dad proud. It's fun for him, no matter what. He got to get dressed up. He looks like a Rick Cowboy. He's gotten a lot of attention from the girls, and so he's feeling pretty good. <laughs> Now the rodeo resumes tomorrow afternoon at 2 o'clock, and organizers tell me there are still plenty of tickets left for purchase. Live in Clovis, Tony Body, CBS 47, on your side.